Well, I guess we'll call this one uh, out with the new and in with the old. We got this uh, 73 bus over here. Uh, engine fire once upon a time, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, it's been sitting in here for a while, and uh, my son thought he wanted it, but he's not really interested, and uh, I personally have no use for it. It's uh, 73, like I said, and it's a little bit too new for me. It's uh, what they call a bay window. You can see the front windshield there is a great big windshield. And it doesn't really fit in with the stuff I have around here. I do have one bay window, a 71 Westphalia camper that I'll keep. But uh, anyway, uh, somebody stopped by and apparently needs this more than I do. So... Uh, Tomorrow, on Saturday, I guess it's going to go away. Um, so we'll say out with the new. Um, anyway, on uh, this last Tuesday, lo and behold, uh, another, another acquisition for Barney's Beetle Barn right here. This here is uh, December of 61, uh, single cab been sitting in a field for I don't know quite a while I guess I think it was registered last in 2000 and uh, anyway so it's been sitting around and uh, needed a home and apparently this is it so pick one up one's gotta go and uh, anyway so this one here has found a new home another single cab uh, it has a little little bit of bondo here on the front take a take a look at this um, anyway maybe I could give uh, VW Darren a new bondo board anyhow uh, so we'll have to peel all that crap off the front and see uh, see what there is um, it doesn't look that beat to where it should have that much Bondo on it, but anyway, it's a it's a truck like all the rest of them. It is a uh, double cargo door, which means that it has one of these side uh, cargo doors on each side. It has one on both the driver's side and across the way there underneath there's one on the passenger side I have yet to get it open um, have to climb inside there and clean the rest and this and that it's a fairly solid car as they go there aren't that many holes in the in the cargo area there's a few it's not too bad the bed itself is uh, fairly solid couple of different engine lids for it, one there and one laying over there and uh, some miscellaneous crap apparently it was full of beer bottles and uh, the person uh, that got rid of it was uh, in charge of taking care of the beer bottles so that saves me the hassle anyway it'll be a cool, pro cool project when it's time but for now, I got to get that green uh, van out of there and um, make it go away. Anyway, thanks for watching.